What's up world? It's me, Gary with the G. Click, click. Bang. What's up world? It's me, Gary with the G. I'm coming back to you today with another one. This one is one coming back from the range today. We had a good day with the fam and friends. Went out to the range. We let off a lot of rounds, different calibers, had a good time. But while we was out there, I was trying to um, speak to the people on the range and uh, I couldn't like they couldn't hear me I'm talking and they couldn't hear me they're like huh I can't you know trying to take off their headphones and stuff like that or earmuffs so I figured you know what I'm gonna shoot a video about going to the range and by the way on the range today how you drop a can of spray paint and it just busts on the ground like literally it, it busts on the ground I got orange paint all over me today but it is what it is. It was still a good day. Appreciate uh, the friends coming out with us today. Good looking on that. I hope you guys had a good time. I'm sure you did. We were shooting guns. So anyway, so again, we was on the range and you know, I'm giving commands. You know, everybody today on the range, because we was at a free public range, everybody was safe as can be. So that was a good thing. You know, when it was time to uh, shut it down and, and I call a, a ceasefire, and the range go cold, everybody down range, safe, nobody touching weapons, it was a good day, I appreciate that. But yeah, so I figured, alright, today I'm going to shoot a video and I'm going to go over some things about heron protection. Because on the range, you should use heron protections. And I guess some people don't know the differences in heron protections, they come in different styles, varieties and stuff like that. I'm going to go over a few that I actually have uh, with me that I use. Um, we're going to start off with the basic, you know, sponges. This one has a 30, it says a 32, uh, rating, decibel rating of killing the noise. This one is you just, you know, you squeeze it, stuff it in the air, it expands and you know, it, it deads the noise. This one says 32 and an NRR. I, I wouldn't think it'd be that high, but that's what it says. I don't know the ratings on all of these that I, I'm showing you, but you can check them out. Here are uh, some that I picked up a while ago. Yeah, you like the color? They come in all different sizes and colors. You know, hey, if it work, it work. I think these are like a 34 NRR, so it deadens it by 34 uh, dBs, which is a, it's a lot, you know. You really can't handle nobody if, you know, yeah, it's killing the sound of the gunshots, but you can't handle nobody if you got these on in, in, a, in a range type setting. You can't hear. So I don't know if I, I like these. And, you know, if you don't got nothing else and at the range, they will give you these for like 50 cents or whatever. And they'll rent these to you for a dollar, two dollars, whatever they rent at the range. They'll rent it and you could buy these probably like maybe 10 bucks. These would be like 10 bucks at Walmart or Amazon, one of those places. Another one similar to it, as you notice, this is a bigger cup, and this one, same. So, same thing with this. This is like a, a 20, this is about 3M, so like a 20 something, 27 NRR rating. And same thing, you know, you put it on, yeah, it deadens the sound. You, you really can't hear much, but it does the job. But again, it deadens the sound. But if we're on a range together, you can't hear me giving a command, you know. We might tell you stop firing, somebody's down, something going on that you might need to know. You can't hear with these. So these are earmuffs, non-electronic. So we're going to go into electronic earmuffs next. Now the good thing about electronic earmuffs, here's some by Walker. I like Walker. Walker makes a lot of different accessories to go with their headphones. So this particular one is um, electronic. So what this is on this walker, you could turn on the mic 
and you can actually hear people talking while it's still deadening the noise around you, but you can hear voices. The gunshots will be muffled, but voices will come through clear. You know, you can turn up the, the volume how, however loud you need it to be to hear the voices, which is good, especially, like I said, from a standpoint of you want to know what's still going on on the range while you're shooting your weapon. And with these, they have a, a plug-in, so you can actually plug your phone in with a you know 3.5 millimeter, 3.5 millimeter uh, plug-in adapter. Again, may not be good for everybody because guess what? A lot of phones don't even have that plug-in no more. But it's it's on there. These are low profile too. You see, these are much slimmer than these. So when you're when you're holding your rifle or anything like that, it's it's not as in the way as this one would be, you know? So yeah, so these are walkers. This is the Razor, low profile or a slim version, something like that, but these are, are, are excellent. You know, you could get these for anywhere from 40 to $60, you know, depending if it's on sale or not. I think I got them for like 34, you know, on sale. And when they went on sale, because I, I have so many go people going shooting with me, with me a lot, I bought like four or five of them. Um, so yeah, I have those and I have these Again, so the good thing with these they are a, You know, you can add on to this so with these particular walkers you can add a walkie-talkie on it So you could just clip it on the walkie-talkie and You and another person could speak um, to each other without Everyone else saying on it and you could be far away. I think it's like up to like 60 to 100 feet or something like that. So I mean, it's a cool feature. You may not need it, but as instructors, instructors would would need something like that so they could communicate with them if one is downrange and one is back at the uh, ready line. All right. Another electronic um, headphone set, and these I think are like 23 NRR, so it's still good enough to block the sound, but it's not enough to just drown it out where you can't hear nothing uh, going on. You know, we're not trying to sleep. We just don't want that loud uh, ruckus from the gunshots deafening our air, giving us that ringing sound. So these again are by Howard, Howard Light. They make some cool ones. This is the Impact Sport. These were the first electronic headphones I got. Now, and I, I mean, I, it made it night and day of being on the range because now I can still hear people around me again while deadening the sound of the gunshots this one had the little knob on the side not at the top i don't know if these are expandable i don't see anything online that can you know you can upgrade this to get um uh walkie talkie top style headsets to add on to this but still these are like 30 40 bucks on amazon all day long and they work well again has that 3.5 millimeter jack on it don't know why it's on there now because guess what again who uses the auxiliary port anymore the phones don't even come with them no more but if you wanted to listen to music and you did have one let's say you had one of the older model phones and you wanted to listen to it you could put your auxiliary cord and listen to music while you while you're playing and um it comes to me thinking about a time i went to go visit my mom out in atlanta and I took it to the range, and there was some knuckleheads in there, man. Like, you know, we're about they just they just got on on the on the set, and we was there already. You know, I'm I'm training with my mom. You know, we was, she was shooting like a revolver, or something like that. And before she took a shot, I'm like hold on, cause I see something. And what I saw was somebody in, the, and we're indoors at that, so it's even louder indoors, and. Dude had on no air protection. He didn't have one. No foams, no headsets, no electronics, no nothing. So I'm like, hold, hold on, hold up. I'm like, yo, you know, go ahead, get some time to put some headphones on. And he was like, nah, I'm good. I don't need them. I looked at, I looked at him like, is you stupid, man? Like for real? You don't need them? I'm like, you must not like your hearing. Good luck with that. All right, go ahead, bust your shots, ma. Let it go. You know what I mean? Like. How could you be so dumb, man? Don't, don't be so tough. You ain't gotta be tough, man. You don't gotta be tough. Wear your head, wear your eye protection and your air protection, man. It, it, it only benefits you. You know, don't be, don't be like uh, 
you know, you're too good to wear those. You know what I mean? Unless you just like, you know. But I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna tell dude nothing. You know, it's a bunch of guns in the, in the, in the place right now. So I wasn't gonna go no farther. If you don't want to wear them, you don't want to wear them. All right, so back to these headphones. But now, other than these over the ear style headphones or the foam that you plug in, Walker makes these. These are like almost like Bluetooth headset type um, uh, air protection. And with this one, it comes in this case that you charge the whole case, which charges each plug separately. You know what I mean? So you just set it in the case, you charge the whole case. Now the good thing is, if your batteries run low, you can put it back in the case, even if it isn't charged, it has another charge already built in the case where it would charge it while it's just resting in the case. That's a great feature. And with these, I'm gonna show you. These are like the foams almost, because you squeeze it, right? And when you squeeze it, Put it in your ear. Do I got the right one now? It goes in this one. Put it in your ear. And it looks just like that. And by the time it expands in your ear, believe it or not, it does work. I mean, it works. I, I seen, um, I bought this from Classic, uh, Classic Firearms. I seen Clint wearing them. And I, I just put them in my cart. I bought them again. I, I think I said that before in another video. I bought these by accident. But I'm glad I did, cause look, talk about forget low pro. You, ain't, you don't got nothing there. There's nothing in the way. It ain't coming out, no matter what you do. It ain't coming out. And the good thing about it is I'm gonna show you, is when you plug them in, when you plug these bad boys in, it comes with an app with them as well. All right? So, and with that app, let me turn them on. So all you gotta do to turn them on is uh, press the both sides. It'll, it'll come on and say walkers. It'll let you know it's connected to your phone. And then on your phone, there's an app, right? Where's that app at? Right there. There's an app called walkers right there. Oh, right here, right there. You click on that app. Let's click on that app. All right. And it comes up, and now you can control how much voice voice um, recognition you want. You can change it for clear voice, universal, power boost. If you're listening to music, so I could throw on Pandora, I could throw on Pandora, and listening to music from my phone while I'm shooting, and still can hear everything going on around me. Like it's, and it's, it's definitely it's working. Like you know, it's I don't even know the rating. But the gunshots don't know, you know, I heard, I've shot um, the Desert, shot 357s, ARs, ARs with, with monster muzzle brakes on them, like the cookie cutters that really just make a lot of racket. And, I mean, you, can, you can't really hear it at all. But you can hear the voices and everything clear. And if, when I play the music in the background, when I hit Pandora, and I go to Pandora, in the background, I'm just listening to music, doing my thing in my zone, you know, taking my shots. And you got a, on here, you also have a icon where you can say, okay, I want you to go to sleep after two hours. So if you see, it's, if I left it sitting somewhere after two hours, it'll automatically just, just shut down. So that's a good feature. Um, it hooks to your Facebook, you know, people could, People can actually share stuff with you through Facebook or um, Instagram. I mean, it's a cool little, cool little app, but the price tag on it ain't cheap. The price tag ain't cheap. I think they every bit of like two hundred and sixty dollars, probably even three hundred dollars. But it ain't cheap at all. But I think it's worth it, you know. Especially if I don't lose it, because that'd be the worst thing. And you know, they got the cleaning brush with it. You clean it out when you finish. You know, take it out your ear. You clean it out. Put it back, turn it off, pressing the buttons again. And you put them back in the case. See, has the blue light that shows you it's charging. Close the case and you just put this case away and now they're charging it. They're charging again so they stay charged every time you're ready. So I keep this in my range bag. So anytime I grab my range bag, I know it's good to go. And like, 
the battery lasts forever, you know. So every like once a week or it depends on how many how much times I've been at the range or how long I was practicing. Like once a week I just charge it back up, put it back in my range bag, and I'm good to go. So I do appreciate y'all guys, you know, sticking with me, sticking through. Go ahead. If you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. If there's something that you think other people would enjoy, why don't you share this video with them? And as always, leave me a comment. Tell me what you think. You know, we, we like the feedback. We do like the feedback. Uh, we got some more videos coming your way. You know, just stay tuned. Be patient. Protect your ears, man. You know, Wu-Tang say protect your neck when you're on the range, man. Protect your ears, man. It's worth it. You know what I mean? All right. Peace. I'll see y'all on the next one. It's me. And you already know. <laughs>